My name is Oliver Gassmann. I'm professor of technology management at the University of St. Gallen in Switzerland, and I'm a member of the board of Zürich. An ecosystem is a multilateral alliance where several partners with complementary resources get together in order to provide a superior value proposition to the customer. Ecosystems are extremely important because we have to align towards the customer journey and multi-partners actually have to get together along the customer journey to create a superior value proposition. Well, there are ecosystems in the health system, for example, when you have insurance companies together with doctors, with um, uh, paying systems, and they all work actually together for providing a seamless um, a journey of, uh, of the customer, of the patient. Another example is the energy sector, where actually a lot of utilities actually work together with platform providers in kind of smart grids and get together uh, in order to provide a superior value proposition for the house owner, for example. Well, most important in order to build up actually an ecosystem is first to be open to develop actually collaborative capabilities, the ability actually to work with somebody together, the complementary partner, open up yourself and also be able in complex partnerships to still pivot and learn actually what the customer actually really wants to have because typically it's an ecosystem innovation. So it's something what hasn't been there before. So it's not actually something what you can get with very clear requirement engineering. It's something where you have to learn and to be just close uh, in the customer journey. Most important is the right mindset to co collaborate and to build the capabilities to work in partnerships and to work in multilateral partnerships, especially very difficult for mature companies. Well, ecosystems often fail because everybody wants to be the orchestrator. Everybody wants to be in the center. Everybody wants to be not captured on a competitor's platform. That's what I call the platform paradox. Uh, everybody wants to create their own platform. And that's why the scale economies and network effects don't happen. And too often, Ecosystems among large players are not agile enough, uh, do not pivot their value proposition enough. And that's why um, at the end uh, they fail in order to succeed actually in front of the customer. Well, the biggest success factor for ecosystems is walk along the customer journey. Listen to your customers deeply and really deeply means see the customer journey which is going across your industry borders across your company borders and then actually look for complementary partners which can actually um, uh, help you to create actually a, a better value proposition and then actually um, you need to be able to collaboratively work together with those partners create actually alliances get all the legal stuff done but be able to learn uh, from the customer within the journey. Well, governments have an important role. First, deregulation. I think it's extremely important that it's just easy to collaborate and it's easy to set up actually a, a new ventures. In other places like smart cities, um, uh, which is very important for Singapore, you need actually to get the right framework um, because an ecosystem, a smart city is actually, uh, has to fulfill actually the requirements of the citizens of the local economy and of the government and to fill or fulfill all that you need to provide the right infrastructure which is kind of the digital backbone of the of a city and that is something what an individual company actually often is not allowed and not able actually to provide by themselves so government can develop and provide an excellent infrastructure and i think singapore is a perfect example for that that this succeeds